Welcome back to another episode of DIY Solar Energy. Actually, a couple months after I started the project, I've got all the plywood and got some walls built and I threw some more stuff back in here for the hurricane. So I'm going to get in here and get these plywood out and finish insulating and get the plywood put up. I've got some help today, so I've got to get uh, get it completed. I've got a door for here, so I gotta build a header. And let's get this thing started. <laughs> plywood move I'm going to go ahead and measure um, for this upper piece of plywood go ahead and get it in here before I finish insulating so let me go ahead and get that measured get the saw horses out and get this plywood cut and get this up here so as you can see I got the first plywood on the roof for the ceiling in this part so now change of clothes I gotta finish insulating a couple spots here and over there. Then I can start uh, putting the last piece of plywood on the ceiling over there and then one little spot right here. And then I can start putting the plywood on the walls and we'll get this part enclosed. Okay, so another change of clothes. We've got 99% uh, of all the insulation done. We little spot right here we'll do at the very end because I'm going to change that wall just a little bit. Uh, everything here is insulated. Um, you can't see up here but uh, and I'll show you in some other videos how that is set up. But what we're going to do now is while I still got some help is I'm going to go ahead and get the plywood on this back wall right here and get it uh, screwed in. I don't know if we'll get the uh, wireways or the inverters mounted today or even in this video but uh, this is a small little series so we will certainly uh, get that done in the next video or two okay let's take you mobile in here for just a moment kind of give you a view so we got this sheet of plywood up here and these are half inch thick plywood no I'm lying to you they're five eighths uh, five eighths so um, I've got uh, told you I liked a little bit left on the insulation I got that spot but I've got to add a two by four right there so when I bring the plywood in it has something to mount to then a piece here so that wall is completed and then we like that area right there so, but what I've been using, and I wanted to show you all, I've been using these inch and a quarter screws to hold this up. But, sadly, that will not work holding inverters. So, I really wish I had some two inch, but I've got some two and a half. So, let me set you up on a time lapse so I can get uh, these screws in where the inverters are going to go to hold this plywood. Okay, so now you saw that I have the big two and a half inch screws in the main plywood where the inverters are going to be mounted. So now uh, I've got to cut this board over here, about right here. I'll use my little blade to cut that uh, little re uh, reciprocating saw or uh, isolating saw. There we go. That way I can uh, have a place over there to mount and then uh, I'll get I'll cut a piece here for the bottom and we'll go ahead and get uh, that last part done and then we'll get a piece put over here but I want to finish that out um, for the insulation so at this point 
I'm going to go ahead and cut a piece for down here. Okay, so I got the other board cut. Now it doesn't quite have the finish as this upper one does, but uh, it's okay because all of this is going to kind of get painted anyway. So let's get this on. Okay, so we have all of this uh, one part right here completed and I'm stepping on stuff. So now to cut this edge, cut the plywood for here, here, and I need to finish insulating that one little part. So let's get to it. Okay, before we close out this video, uh, I didn't get everything I wanted to get done today, but uh, we have a lot of episodes we can do. This is YouTube. We don't have to get it all done at once. But I wanted to mention that apparently it's very hard to get that stuff. And if you order that stuff, the certain suppliers will not ship you the correct things. So, demonstration. Oh, what is this? This is a wire away. 90. Oh, it's a two inch. So I placed an order from a company online, which I'm not gonna bash them. They did give me my money back, but it's taken an act of Congress. So I ordered, uh, essentially I ordered this wire away. Well, they shipped me a two inch and they apologized and it's like, well, let's go ahead and ship you another 90 and they shipped me the exact same one and i told the lady I says this isn't cutting it this is the second or third time i've had an issue with ordering stuff from them so the first time was these i was going for six inch wire away but they shipped me four thus i had six inch 90 in end caps i so I've already got four inch wire away. So I'm gonna go ahead and do four inch, see how that's gonna work. So I ordered a 90 from another supplier and a T from another supplier and a stubby two foot from another supplier. And I got all of the parts here. So I don't know how four inch is gonna work. Um, I really don't, but we're gonna give it a shot. And if you're interested in any of the two inch wire way 90s I have, uh, shoot me a message, email me, go over to the about on YouTube. My email address is there. If you pay for shipping, you can have, uh, 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 I've got two of these 90s. So if, uh, if you've got two inch wire way and you need a 90, let me know. You pay for shipping, we'll uh, get it to you. I'm not quite sure on the six inch yet whether i'm going to get rid of that 90 in those end caps even though that one i paid for didn't get my money back but um the two inches i did <laughs> eh, we'll just leave that in the two inch i uh, get that did get refunded for so um if you want that let me know so let me give you an update on the solar panels so nothing has changed and the fence is still not repaired. There is a massive backlog on getting uh, construction workers or laborers. Right now, uh, they're just so backlogged from the storms that we keep having down here. So unfortunately, uh, it may not be until winter before I get my fence fixed. But back to this, nothing has been done. I've uh, picked up some more components to uh, uh, make some changes to this. I'm going to still keep the style, but I want to change certain aspects of this. 
and uh, you'll see that coming in some future videos so for now i do thank you very much for watching make sure to like comment and share and uh on the next one hopefully we'll uh finish getting the plywood added and maybe get up the uh the wireways so well at least hopefully we can finish getting uh the uh the part uh plywood and definitely get some electricity in here uh for now okay you guys take care thank you very much hey make sure you subscribe <music>